how to use Trello for event planning. Hello friends, welcome to another tutorial. In this video, you will learn how you can use Trello for event planning. So ensure you watch to the end, all right? Don't be in a hurry. This tutorial will be a quick one. So using Trello for event planning can help you stay organized and manage all tasks involved in creating a successful event. And here is a step-by-step -step guide to get you started. The first step is to sign in to your Trello account once you're signed in. The next step is to create an event board. And then after you do that, Move to the left side of the screen and then click on bots. And then once you click on bots, you brought to the page where you would see all of your bots. Once you can see all of your bots, you can decide to like edit any of these bots here to make an event bot. Or you can just go to the top part of the screen, click on the plus icon, click on start the template, and then you can scroll down and locate a bot that's similar to an event bot. All right. Okay. If you can't see, if I click on Explore Template, and then you'll be redirected to another page where you'll see a list of templates with edits by the left side of the screen. You can see design, engineering, marketing, personal, productivity. Just scroll down. And if you can't see the one you're looking for still, then the next step or the next thing you will do is to click on business, something related to what your need you need. Okay. And then you can just click on the search box and type out event. So you search for it. And then you can see the template available speaker guide for online event. It is easy. You can just select it and create. And then just like that, the board will be created and you'll be redirected to the board's page or the board's, yeah, the board's page. Once you're in this page, the next step is to break down your event into faces. All right. Now, on every bot, there are always lists right here. There are always lists. So, as you can see, there are different lists here. So, your first step is to use each of these lists uh, as a means of breaking down your event into your faces. So, if the events that you're working on has, for example, three faces, such as pre-event, during event, and post-event, you just organize your list, your bot with these lists. A list could be pre-event, the other one event, and then the other one after event. And inside this list, you then add cards, all right? Each of these cards would have tags, okay? Each of these cards, we have tags. And then you can invite your team members, your your event planning team members to the board so that everyone can contribute and stay updated on the progress. And then um, you, after adding the cards, you would ensure that each of the cards have individual taxes or items that need attention. Then assign due dates to each of these cards so as to foster productivity. And then, for example, this is a card here, and it is called Prepare for Q&A. So if you want to um, add due dates to this, just click on the pencil icon here, and then click on Edit Date, and then you can see Start Date, Due Date. Okay, so you can just change this date or uh, depending to just suit you, depending on the time schedule that you're working with. And then once you're done, click on save, and just like that, the due date will be had there. So whoever is assigned to this tax will know when he or she is due. And then you can do this for each of the cards as well. And so that why while dividing your taxes, they are divided into actionable um, points and all. So you can also use labels for categorization, for example, maybe labels to represent each tax. Some tax could be marketing, some tax to, could be logistics. Ensure you use labels to differentiate this. Okay, so you can also check, keep on checking your list to monitor your progress. All right, so it's very simple, okay? Very simple to be very easy to use Trello for event planning. Just follow all of the procedures shown in this video and you will be able to do it. I hope this story has been helpful. Thanks for watching. And have a good day.